The screen layout includes the patient header at the top of the screen, which displays the current patient name, ID number, institution, and date and time of the study. The symbols displayed on the right of the screen provide information about system status. There is information on the exam type, transducer, AC connected, battery level, and a number indicating the amount of internal storage remaining. The system meets the AIUM standard by providing a continuous display of the mechanical index. When the image is frozen, you can select a frame by scrolling with the gain knob, touchpad, or arrow keys. This number indicates the frame displayed. If the A and B shortcut keys have functions assigned, an icon for each key will be displayed here. If a USB memory stick is in use, a USB icon will be displayed to indicate it is active. Just to the left of the symbols, the depth marker displays marks in 0.5 cm, 1 cm, and 5 cm increments, depending on the depth. The mode data is displayed at the top left of the screen. The current image mode information, such as Gen, Res, Pen, THI, Sono HD, or Sono MB, will be displayed here. When color Doppler is active, the pulse repetition frequency will be displayed. When pulse Doppler is active, the pulse repetition frequency will be displayed and information regarding the angle of the ROI box, the sample line angle, and the sample volume size will be displayed. If a calculation package has been selected, the calculation menu and measurement results will be displayed to the bottom left of the screen. This completes the overview on the system control panel and screen layout. Now that you are finished with the overview of the system, you are ready to scan.